What a welcoming committee! To greet you. HK Chassis! Yes! Marvellous! Well, look at Paul Bowden looking a bit battered and bruised. Entertainment module. Because we want to go and speak with Lieutenant Gren. So you've returned? Yes. I'd like to talk to you about the bounties. What is it? Uh, I've, killed the, I've killed the escaped criminals. I see. And where and when did you kill them? What is with your tone? I've followed them to the restoration zones. And there, they were posing as circuit security. So I killed them. I see. Well, you certainly earned the bounty on those two dangerous criminals. Here it is. I think you'll find the amount more than adequate. The TSF once again thanks you for your cooperation. Why, thank you. Right, well, we may have done. So However... You return. What's he doing here? I don't here? have anything for you, but thanks for saving my life. I'll try and return the favor someday. Ah, well... I'll hold you to it. Whoa, look at that! Wow! Where do all these come from? I'll take them all, thank you. <laughs> maybe I missed one when I was looting it the first time round, or maybe it's an added bonus. Anyway. What, did exa what exactly did we pick up? A new vibro sword. One of them. Uh, a mining laser. Another grey Jedi robe. A military suit. Arcanian blinders. Gomerian, uh, Gomerian gauntlets. Safety harness. Mess hall log. Storage log. Storage. Minor log. Broken items. Ionite edge, which is a weapon. Upgrade to my sword. And some droid stuff. And another underlay. Quite a quite the loot there. Is there a storage item in here or just no this is the prison area? Okay, let's get out of here. Right, um We'll just pop into the cantina, see if anything's new in town. I doubt it, but uh, we'll just see. Over. Ooh, twelve hundred. Wow, that's nice. Thank you so much. Seems that I have been paid paid back uh, very handsomely for investing in that little mission to rescue her. So, 
one final thing I want to do on here is uh, go to the Emporium, just make sure that there is nothing in stock that I want from these guys. Look, now that I have a bit more money. Uh, right, we've got 12,000 credits. We could actually start purchasing some, 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 uh, I think we'll go by filters. Some weaponry. Uh, of course we picked up a Sith War Sword before, but it's a two-edged weapon which we're not going to use because we're going to be focusing on single blade combat. We've got some armor. The Norris Robe. 1,100. Defense bonus of 2 and 20% immunity to energy. No, I think I prefer my grey robes. Zishan Shah Initiate Armor. This is light armor and does not restrict the use of force powers. Defense bonus of 4 and uh, plus 1 to fortitude save. No, I still prefer my armor. Defense bonus. Verpine Fiber Mesh. 200,000? Is that 20,000? 20, wow. Of course, we're not going to invest in any upgrades for our companions. <laughs> they can get the dregs off the battlefield. If we're going to splash the cash, it's going to be on ourselves. Nagai Combat Gloves. Unarmed Accuracy Gloves. Hmm, they would be good for about there. And they're not that expensive, really. Tarry Survival Gloves. Insulated Gloves. Thermal Shield. Generator. Biotech. Implant. Nerve Enhancement. Skill system. Wow, that's oh, pretty nifty indeed. So some nice things, but uh, nothing that Shalar can make massive use of. Miscellaneous crystals for her lightsaber. Red crystal for her lightsaber. I think I might buy that for when I do finally get my lightsaber. I want my lightsaber to be red. Would be nice. Uh, parts 200. Targeting scope, bleem splitter, some Pazak cards. None of the plus and minus ones though. Um, no, we'll leave that for now. Okay. Ah, workbench. Ah, this is good because I've got two people with me that I have that have higher skills in certain things. So I might just have another look at the workbench while I'm here. Special reserves first. A yeah, Chani Vibro Sword. Now this seems to be an upgrade to what I already have, but it's very expensive. So I'm not going to go for it. <laughs> Too expensive. Pretty nice, actually. This a belt. Yeah. Okay, miscellaneous. Severe Deveronian Edge. A nice upgrade to Shalar's sword. A very nice upgrade to Shalar's sword. Flexible underlay. No. I'm tempted. Is this is something she can make good use of at this moment in time. Although she's not very good with her sword though. Okay, I'll do. Regular wares, please. Longsword, or oh, what's this? Riot Buster. Exchange casual gloves, insulated gloves, crystal silver. Ooh. Some grenades and some stimulants. I just made that myself. You have to excuse me. Right, workbench. Create or break down items. Let's have a look. Yeah? Let's do it with bow.
Lauder first. He has the high repair and things, so uh, let's have a look what he can create here. Armour. Can he make anything that Shalar needs? Bio restorative Mark III? No. Doesn't have a high enough treat injury. So that's the only thing we want to make with Shalar. Wait a second, let me have a look here. What's his repair? Repair is 18. Atom has repair 0. Computer use 7. Computer use 18. So he's got good computer use and good repair. Security 18 as well. machine is there. So he can make some pretty nice things with his with his stats if we were to want to do it. What can we do for Shalar's weapon? What I'm going to do is I'm going to just pause it. Obviously you don't want to see me mulling over all this stuff, but there's some really nice stuff here that I haven't seen before. So I'm just going to pause it, have a look through my own time, and then I'll resume in a second. Alright, so I've uh, checked out... How's we go? I've checked out some of the, um, the items that he can create, and uh, I've once again decided not to buy any of them, or not to create any of them. They cost components and components are valuable. Especially when I get my lightsaber, I would rather use them for that. No point of putting a whole heap of components into upgrades for a sword when I won't be using it for the entirety of the game, for instance. So uh, I'm just gonna hold off from creating anything until I got my lightsaber, then we can uh, start getting some upgrades for that. Anyway, I think we're done here. No, we're not. Not quite. I just want to see what will happen if we go to Circa Corporation with Baudot our party to see if there's anything to say. Uh, there? Yeah, Circa Corporation. Hmm, still seems relatively calm. I've brought a guest with me, Diana. Where is he? Maybe he refuses to come in. Ah, here we are. Let's see if we can, let's see if he says anything. Welcome back. No. What's going on? You want to speak to her? Welcome back. No. Okay. But well, we tried. Just say the word. Come. So, I don't think, I could be wrong of course, but I don't think there's anything else we can do here. Not that, nothing that springs to mind anyway. So uh, we'll go back on our ship, install the new HK droid part that we've just got, and then we shall jet off to Dantooine. Go, go, go! Like the speed of light! Okay, doors opening and doors closing. And in we go. to engage in conversation there with somebody. Right, re uh, reinforcing the droid's damaged chassis, 
with the one we just acquired. Ah, oh, his chest has now stopped sparking. But there is one more item to retrieve before our HK friend comes back online, and that is a droid processor. Okay, so we are going to jet off to our first new planet, and as I say, it's going to be Dantooine. planet's surface and see what is in store for us. If I can find the way out, of course. There, there we go. But it seems like it's an appropriate place to leave off. Why start a new planet now when we're going to have to end the session in about 10 minutes time anyway? So, we're going to end it now, so during the next time, when we shall go onto Dantui's surface and uh, find out what's going on down there. And uh, who are we looking for on Dantooine? Master Vrook, by the looks of it. So we'll see if we can uh, locate him. As well as keeping our eye out for lightsaber parts and of course the all-important droid processor. So join me then. See you soon.